Kelly from the Chattanooga Zoo, and thank you for joining us today. I'm here with my friend Max, the Eastern Box Turtle. Are you excited for our program today? We sure are. Let's go. Hi friends, thanks for joining me on our zoo safari. I have my safari outfit on, and these are our black crested manga bees. They're monkeys found in Africa, and they are great at climbing. That's their favorite form of movement. They use their hands and their feet to climb, but also to walk around. You might think that since they're monkeys, they use their tails, but they do not. Their tails are just to help them balance when they're swinging through the trees, or in this case, our ropes. Hi, so can you show them your hand? Good job. So like I said, these guys love to climb. We can also climb using our hands and feet. I know I love to climb trees. What about you? I bet you do, because it's a pretty fun activity. So we're gonna go off and see our next friend and learn more about movement. Come on, guys. Hi, friends. So our next animals that we're visiting are our fish that you can find in Africa and our turtles. So both these animals, while very different, move in similar ways. They like to swim. So the fish, you can see that they're going to swim with their fins, whereas the turtles are going to use their legs. They have webbed toes, so just like a duck, so they can swim in that water and go fast. But they can also use those legs for walking when they come on ground. So, well, fish don't like to come out of the water, turtles do, but they can both swim when they're in water and the turtles can use those legs for either swimming or walking on the ground. So, like I said, lots of different animals can move in different ways. Let's go see some more. Come on. Hi, friends. So we are here visiting the Temistimas. They're kind of like crocodiles or alligators, but a little bit different. And as you can see, they are in the water. They love to swim, but they can't live in the water their whole life. They're holding their breath right now. So they swim around, and that's their form of movement when they're in the water. But when they're on the ground, they use those legs to kind of crawl and walk. And they can walk, but they're so close to the ground, I think it looks like crawling. So they use their hands and their feet, their legs and their arms to swim and to crawl. So let's see what more of our zoo friends do. Come on. Good. Hi friends, we're here with our cougars, CJ and Montana. And right now they're laying down, enjoying their morning, but their type of movement is going to be leaping, walking, running, and they're also really good at climbing. They're known as cougars, pumas, Florida panthers, but really they're most commonly known as mountain lions. So they're great at being able to go up mountains and down mountains quickly. They can actually leap after a white-tailed deer if they are feeling hungry for dinner. So those paws are really important and kind of like the manga bees that we met, they like to use their tail for balance, just like a kitty cat at home when they've got the zoomies and they're running around, that tail helps them balance. Hi friends, we're visiting our finnick foxes and you're gonna hear their little squeaks and squeals and I think they're just precious, but we're talking about movement today. And so our finnick foxes are really fast. They are great at using those legs and those arms to run really quickly on desert sand. They'll come out at night so that the sand isn't hot, it's nice and cold at night. And they'll use those legs to dig a tunnel and then they will run really quickly across the desert floor. So, I like to run as well, but these finnick foxes are a lot faster than me. Let's check them out. We are here to visit with our goats and these guys love to do all types of movement. You can tell that they're standing on their legs and so they'll use those for walking but they can also run and they really, really like to climb. So I'm going to grab some of this delicious hay and see if my friend will follow me to the rocks. I got some of my goat friends to climb and show how great they are at using those hooves to be on rocky structures. You want it out of the bowl.
thank you so much for joining us today. We had such a great time. We learned a lot too. We hope you have a great day and we'll see you soon at the zoo.